Start menu. It's Google Chrome, which comes up pretty fast as far as I'm concerned. Of course, not as fast as on a normal desktop, but that's to be expected from such a small machine, so, you know, at least it does something. And OS News is having a slow day, as you can see. We're probably working on it somewhere. Um, okay, that can go. Of course, this is the computer. I have no idea what the... Oh, that's the little SD card I put in. I forgot. So, that works. Oops, okay. Um, let's bring up mail, just for fun. Oh, there it is. It's about just as fast as on my desktop machine, actually. It's really not a very noticeable delay. Right there. Um, of course, you're not going to be able to read um, what it says, but um, it is a uh, Windows Experience Index rating, whatever the hell that means, of 2.6. I'm probably, I'm sure some Windows nut jobs know what that means. I don't actually. Um, it's got a uh, Intel Atom processor, the cheap N270 model, 1.6 gigahertz. It's hyperthreading, of course, so it lists two of them. Uh, it's got 1.5 gigabytes of memory, it's of course 32-bit and all that stuff. Um, there used to be a solid state drive in this thing, but I replaced it with a 30-gigabyte, uh, 1.8-inch uh, ZIF drive. Uh, and in case you didn't know, uh, ZIF stands for Zero Insertion Force, it's just the type of connector it uses. Um, uh, it's a 30 gigabyte, as I said, um, 4200 uh, RPM, so it's one of those slow ones. It's actually uh, an iPod drive. It was destined to go into an iPod, but uh, Hitachi sells these things uh, uh, individually as well. It has a little Apple logo on it, actually, so... Um, here, it's probably in disk drives, right? Or is it? I don't know. Here, look, Toshiba. It's the MK3008 GAL outside device. It did require a bit of uh, manual labor to get it in because you have to remove some of the, uh, the struts that you know used to house the uh, SSD and you have to cut it out and all that stuff. And the uh, ZIF cable that, that comes with the uh, the SPR1 is a bit weird because it has a little um, um, well, a little layer of crap on it, so to speak, a little layer of plastic that you need to sand down with a nail file. That's probably the only time I've ever bought a nail file in my entire life. Um, and I have 10 of them now because they come in 10 only, in packs of 10, which sucks balls. Um, um, what else can I show you? Well, well, of course, I, you know, move to the normal start menu, not the weird super start menu that fills half of the screen because not only is it extremely pointless, it's also extremely annoying to use. Um, I didn't disable any services on this, on this, 